Tiene tiene una persona, tiene, tiene una bolsa, algo, lonche, no, 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 On a beautiful day in Florida, officers were called to a local Walmart where a new employee was being investigated for a major fraud scheme. Here's how it worked. While working as a cashier, the employee would grab gift cards off the shelf, load them up with $400 to $500, and mark them as paid when in fact, no one had paid for the gift cards at all. She would also steal cash, scamming over $5,000 in just three days. Reference PVSO case number 23077004. Present with me is Asset Protected Investigator Robert for the Walmart Supercenter. When officers arrived, they met with an asset protection officer who had watched the employee steal gift cards and money over just a few weeks. Even coming in on their day off just to steal, the employee stole over $9,000 in her first month on the job. Hi, API Robert Gardner. I observed the subject now known to me as Lee Doris, uh, loading debit cards up with between 400 to 450 at a time, loading them up and then cashing them out the register without actually putting any money in the till, closing the drawer, and then pocketing the card. Okay. She's an employee, correct? Correct. Do you know how long she's been employed with Walmart? Uh, I want to say about two months, maybe a little less. Approximately two months. Um, when did, what was the date of the first incident, do you recall? April 28th. April 28th. And then when was the most recent? Uh, that would be today, June 9th. And total, how much? How many incidents are we looking for between that time span? That uh, 23. 23 total separate transactions? Separate, yeah. Well, she's done a couple of duplicates on a couple of days. Okay. But so I'm not sure that counts as separate. Or... It would, but in terms of how many we have record of, we have 23 separate recorded transactions yes. where she took gift piece of debit cards, loaded them, and then never put any kind of money into the till. Correct. Okay. Um, and what is the total monetary value of the loss for the company? Uh, current total, not including the one from today, $8,449.80. Um, now, you were the primary API assigned to this whole investigation, correct? Correct. Now, how did you observe Ms. Torres? Was it through recorded camera surveillance or? Through CCTV footage. Okay. Now, when you stated she put it into a pocket, did she put it into a pocket of like her blue work vest? Yes. Each each time she basically took the debit card and concealed it in that blue work vest? Yes. And then proceeded to walk out of the store with that card in her possession? Yes. Okay. Um, how would you describe Ms. Torres? What would she look like? Do you know her physical characteristics? Uh, Vaguely, I'd say mid 20s, maybe early 30s. Uh, light brown skin. Is she black, white? Uh, black. Say kind of Haitian, I'd say. Okay, so she's or a black Islander, black female, probably in her mid 20s. Yeah. Okay. Does she have dark colored hair? Uh, she changes up her color, but yes. Okay. All right, but if you were able to physically see her within the store, you'd be able to physically identify her. Correct? Yes. Okay. Do you know if the business wants to pursue a prosecution? After officers spoke to asset protection, they called the employee to the office. It was reported that she had stolen money just 30 minutes before the officers arrived. <laughs> You have the right to remain silent and not answer any questions. Any statement you make must be freely and voluntarily given. You have the right to the presence and representation of a lawyer of your choice before you make any statement and during any questioning. Buscar representación de un abogado. 
antes, antes de hablar con él sobre este, 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 esta uh, interview, esta interrogación. Okay. If you cannot afford a lawyer, you're entitled to the presence of representation of a court reporting lawyer before you make any statement and during any questioning. Si no puede uh, pagar para una, un abogado, you're entitled to the presence of representation tú tienes el derecho de tener uh, un abogado presente before you make any statement antes de hablar con él sobre the questions. Okay. Not everything I need, mean, so. Okay. Okay. Does she have any personal property? Here? Tiene algo personal en el locker. Okay. Algo, algo que, que tuyo que pues tú no vas a estar aquí más nada. Más Sí, no, tú no, no vas a trabajar en Walmart. ¿Qué me va a hacer? ¿Me va a dar una prisión? ¿En prisión? No sé. Okay. Tiene, tiene una persona, tiene, tiene una bolsa, algo, lonche. Eso solamente, eso con tú tienes para el trabajo. Mi, mi, mi carro. En su carro. No tiene nada aquí. Atrás en el, en el, en el locker room. No. No tiene bolsita o nada. Okay. Tiene algo que le pueden ofender a los policías. Cuchillo. No, no tengo Algo con talla. No tiene nada. She said she has nothing on her that's going to sharp. I'm going to take her outside. I'm not going to do this in here. Yeah, okay. She's some emotional arrest. That's fair. No, no, no. All right. Señora. Yeah, I'm not just in her van. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you te van a arrestar, okay? Okay. Nine thousand. Nine thousand. Her daughters. Nine thousand. Her daughters. Is it because they're in the daycare? Daycare. Her daughter is a daycare. There's a daycare here. Not here. The employee would attempt to notify officers she's a single mom. And she would steal the money because she gets no help from the father. You let us know in the end if you believe her. Somewhere on Silver Beach. What time was she scheduled to leave work? Wait, five thirty. What time do you have to take the girls? Five thirty. Five thirty. She has to take ¿Tienes otra familia que puedes hacer eso o no? No tengo. Yo solamente siempre cuido de mi hija. Ya, no, no, no. Ella dijo que su hija le ayudó. ¿Y el No me importa. Ella no me importa mi hija. Ella no se preocupa de las chicas. Well, it's either that or DCF, so like I said, just the family. It's going to be the Department of Family and Service of Families. What do you do with my kids? For how long do you have to go to the toilet? How long do you have to go to the toilet? I don't know. How long do you have to go to the toilet? Alright, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Just take off the vest and then... Let me talk to you. Yeah, we'll handle that when we get there. Vamos conmigo a buscarlas. Hoy es su último día aquí y te, te, no. So mañana ya hoy no trabaja en Walmart mañana y nosotros vamos a ir. Uh, queremos que uh, te eh, rompiste la ley, ¿me entiendes? Mm -hmm. Rompiste la ley por coger dinero. ¿Ok? Yeah, so it's just not closed yeah, and yeah, it's yeah. terminated. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. That was so yake is a badge. She goes by the name Lud. 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 Short. Point of her. Yeah, I got her information. Mm -hmm. She came back with something. So. Okay. Está lista? O está llamando? Está llamando al padre, no sé. She's just calling yeah, the dad. The dad. Evidence. Which card? That one that was up. Yeah, the one that she took today. Yeah. Please
be so that we can recover those funds yeah. for just that one. Just try to explain to her well, what's, what's in her near future. Whatever you guys need to do on your NSA company. Uh, you want to explain to her what's in her immediate future at all? Like for your guys? Or no, for you. No, no. no. Okay. Yeah, you're fine. As okay. long as you explain everything for you guys. Please read her message for. He is walking towards now. Want to test his own answer? Want to test that? Yeah. 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 Y